Okay, so since you don't believe in green energy like EcoGen Solutions, you're okay with everyone dying as long as it'll benefit the economy in the long run. Wow, bro. You know, I didn't think you'd do that to me. Do what? That's the scarecrow fallacy. The hell is that? You're just going off topic, propping up a hollow argument, hoping it'll stand. You mean a straw man argument? No. Look, man, all I'm saying is that we're almost at peak oil. Global temperature is rising. We really have to like- oh, Okay, so now you're just gonna pile up a bunch of fake facts, hoping that I can't find the needle of truth. That's a haystack diversion. Wow. I've literally never heard of that. Wow. Unless we build for a renewable future now, things are just gonna get more dangerous. That's a haunted hayride conundrum. You said haunted hayride what? You present to take me on a logical, whimsical journey, but really you're just trying to frighten me with a bunch of bullshit. No, you're just refuting my argument with a bunch of crazy autumnal themed stuff. That's a pumpkin patch provocation. Ain't no way you just said that. Planting seeds of doubt to trap me in your patch of lies. You're so predictable. Man, can we just get back on topic to talking about climate change? I'd love to, man, but this is straight out of the fascist playbook. It's like deny, intimidate, then accuse me of cornfield confusion. Like I'm scattering random accusations hoping you get lost in the maze. You're taking me through the cornfield maze. You're literally making this shit up. Textbook DSM vibe, not Meg Narcissist. I'm done with you. That's right, you get up and leave when you can't get vulnerable. That's a ghost me on our apple picking hinge day we plan upstate argument. That's like really specific. I mean, it just sounds like you're hurt. Nah, you just can't debate. So when it's not fall, you just snowman switch up tulip tactics and castle equivocation. Okay, you know what? Forget this. Fine. Bye. <laughs>